At the beginning of the 2023 Syracuse football season, there was no doubt who SU's top target was going to be. Wide open man, Arande Gaston holds it in. But not even two minutes into the second game of the season, this happened. Those over the middle, it's caught by Gaston at the 35, dragged down at the 38 by Tate Halleck. And Gaston is down on the field, clutching his ankle. Syracuse football tight end Aronde Gadsden was declared out for season with a Liz Frank injury on Saturday. The attention then turned to the emerging star Isaiah Jones, who then was notably absent in SU's Week 3 win at Purdue. A week later, Coach Baber said this about Jones. Uh, Isaiah will be down for a while, and I have no dates on that. And yet, with two of their top receivers out, it was the veteran Damian Alford who rose to the occasion for the Orange. The Canadian torched the Army defense on Saturday with 135 receiving yards on nine catches. And when asked about his career day after the game, he had a little smile on his face, but also said preparation for next week starts now. I am happy about it. I'm going to enjoy it today. But I know this week going into practice, I have to prepare myself for a, another physical game. Well, not even just Clemson, just the stretch that we got and making sure that the receivers are already are performing as well because it's not only me, it's them as well. So just taking it week by week and the sky's a winner from there. You know, Alfred is a captain and he has a C on his chest and that doesn't come easy. That means he has not only the faith and the support of the team, but uh, also the coaches as well. And uh, I was excited for him. It was a breakout game for our you know, we used to call him Bambi. Now we call him Moose since he's from Canada. For Damien Alford, who I guess we're going to start calling Moose now, he's peaking at the right time when the Orange need him the most. Looming large above SU's perfect 4-0 record is the Clemson Tigers, who come to the Dome to challenge the Orange on Saturday. Reporting for Citrus TV Sports, I'm Nick Lutrell.